True signs that Christmas is coming. The lights, the seasonal greens adorned with red ribbons, and this. And Joseph, I just wanted to thank you for not giving up on Christmas. The reminders, along with her festively decorated bass, fire up the Christmas tunes on the Mid-South Audio stage. Uh, yeah, we like to refer to it as a warm-up for the big event, Caroling on the Circle in Georgetown. We are only a few weeks away from the 39th annual Caroling on the Circle event. Uh, it is more than singing and merriment. It's a whole lot of that, but mm -hmm. there is more. It's a way to feed thousands this holiday season. Chip Guy is with us this afternoon. He's the Communications Director with the Sussex County and joins us with more information. Good to see you. Thanks Good seeing you. Thank afternoon. you for having yeah. me here. Good afternoon. 39 years. Yeah, it started in the mid-1980s. Um, it was uh, part of a statewide campaign to uh, bring together communities in Sussex, Kent, Newcastle counties, and um, it was part of the Delaware First Initiative, I believe. Yeah. And uh, from that, this has grown into a, uh, a tradition year after year after year. And in 39, almost 40 years, there have been uh, almost 800,000 food items collected in Sussex County alone wow. for area food pantries. So like we're closing in on the million mark. I don't know that we'll get it this year, but, uh, to. but I'd say in the next few years, we'll, we'll be coming close to, uh, to hitting a million food items donated, collected and donated in Sussex County for, for families. And the, the, the food drive actually kicked off a couple weeks ago. Right, we kick it off uh, November 1st mm -hmm. and we run it through the end of December. And so the idea is to give people, you know, who maybe can't make it out to Caroling on the Circle on that Monday night, uh, December the 5th, uh, if they want to still donate, um, they can do so. I know of uh, one, uh, one uh, effort that's going on now uh, with uh, Grain on the Rocks and the Rehoboth Beach Police Department. They are planning an event on December 11th, I believe. It's a Sunday. And they are going to coordinate their collection and then add it to our uh, to our total take nice. so that was fantastic that was a little add-on that I got in the last couple of days and and I love to see that with the community you know it bubbling up and yeah. and it's it's organic and and they're plugging into our event so um, the more the merrier more and more people coming for those who maybe haven't had a chance to come yet tell us what they can expect to see well what you'll expect to see is a gathering of people in your community there in, in Georgetown, in Sussex County. Um, we have an evening of wonderful traditional and Spanish carols. It starts at 6.30 on Monday evening, December the 5th. And um, it's just a lot of, uh, of, of great fellowship and, and festive uh, atmosphere. You've got uh, the singing, and then, and then we, we do a couple of uh, candlelight uh, uh, selections. And uh, then there's a visit in the end by a, a bearded fellow, not you, Jimmy. Not me. <laughs> Not you, okay. but you'll be there. Be, you'll, be there. there. Yeah. you'll be there. Yeah, and this is really a way that um, many community organizations come together Absolutely. in Sussex County. We um, support, I think, close to two dozen food pantries in Sussex County, and um, we usually take in twenty to 30,000 items in, in a year, a good year's 30,000. Uh, we'd like to, to see that number again this year. Uh, you know, with with food prices and inflation mm -hmm. and gas being a concern for a lot of families, everybody, but you know, it's, there's a, an added stress this holiday season and so it's, it's more important than ever to have the community do everything they can to, to help those, you know, your friends and neighbors who might be in need here in our community. Mm -hmm. and, and there's caroling on the circle, but you continue to collect after that. Correct. We, we have the, what's known as the Pack the Pod food drive. It's, right. it's part of the caroling on the circle event. And uh, what we do is we set up a, a 14 by 7 uh, storage shed on the, on the circle. We we dress it up a little bit like a like a package, and and uh, it's a focal point to to give the community uh, an idea that something's going on here. We let them know that you know they can drop off donations anytime right. at the admin building right there on the circle in Georgetown, and then we stuff that that uh, storage pod with all of the items that we take in, canned goods, non-perishable food items. And it goes through the end of December? goes through the end of December. Okay. I think it'll be December 30th this year because that's a Friday. Okay. Um, and uh, then we'll have our, our final tally after that. Well, okay. we're looking forward to it. December 5th, Georgetown Circle. Thank yeah. you so much, Chip, Thank for you, coming Lisa. in today. Thank you, Jimmy.